It's not every day that I get to park somewhere like this, a place that horses and carriages, the great and the good of years gone by, have arrived at the Vine Estate here in North Hampshire. But today is no ordinary day, because today I'm going to be treading in the footsteps of Sir Walter Raleigh, of Elizabeth I, and of Henry VIII himself, as I try and win the chance to become Master of the House. Time now, though, for me to head inside. Firstly, in search of Henry VIII, and secondly, to keep an appointment which could see me becoming Master of the House. Oh, hello there. You must be Kelly. I am, yes. Nice to see you. I'm Martin. Hi, Martin. Now, I understand it's you that stands in the way of me becoming Master of the House. It is. What do I need to do? <laughs> well, <laughs> nothing too hard, just don't worry. Okay. We're going to send you around um, the property with some of our volunteers uh -huh. um, and show you all the wonderful things you've got to see around the house and okay. in the gardens. Uh -huh. And then you're going to come back and answer some rather challenging questions. Oh, very good. And my reward's going to be? Your prize yes. um, will be that you all enjoy an afternoon as if you're master of the house. Maybe taking tea in the saloon, walking around the Oak Gallery, etc. Very good. But if you don't pass, uh -oh. um, you'll be set up doing some of our more difficult uh, tasks that we have around the property, um, very important tasks that help us keep the property going, but you might find slightly more arduous. Such as? Uh, plenty of cleaning, vacuuming, digging, uh -oh. all those sorts of things that just help make the property <laughs> look at its best. I I'm liking the first option better. Okay, then you will better be up for the challenge. Okay, okay. <laughs> it's a fair cop. How long have I got? An hour. And when do I start? Now. Now? OK, I'm, I'm off. See okay, you later. Bye. Ah, Jenny? Uh -huh. Nice Welcome to see you. Martin. I've been set a mission by oh, Kelly to find out as yes. much about the vine as possible. So, what's good to know about the library? So much by the look of it. Oh, absolutely. Well, you've got to say hello to Speaker Shoot. Oh, indeed. Hello, he Speaker Shoot. He was the one who amalgamated and put the foundations of our democracy that we have today. The glass house over there, which part of it's laid out much like an 18th century glass house would have been laid. Okay, yeah. I'm trying to digest all these facts, but I'm aware I've got to get back to the house to meet Kelly. So Chris, thanks very much. Yep. You're welcome. I'll see you later. Yep. Fingers crossed. What have you got for me? A minute to yes. answer some of my questions, uh -huh. starting from now. Name three of the outbuildings on the Vine Estate. There's the ticket office, there's the lodges, the brew house restaurant. Okay, that'll do. What once caused a boy to be lost below ground at the Vine for several hours? Was it that he was stealing apples from the orchard? <laughs> he was helping Wiggett Shoot survey the drains. Miles away. Which wall hangings in the house was Caroline Wiggett workman frightened of as a child? Oh, that's the tapestries in the tapestry room. Correct. Yes. What age is the hundred guinea oak believed to be? Uh, 500 years? Or 600. Just Close a enough. few hundred years between people? <gasps> right, OK, I believe our time is up. I don't think you did particularly well, Martin, and I don't think we're looking at seeing you of Master of the House. What does that mean, then? I mean, it was the time, it was the time factor. That's the bit I found difficult. The pressure? Um, never mind, I think we need to go <laughs> find you something else to do. You're very unforgiving. <laughs> OK. <laughs> now? Now. I know my place. <laughs> Nick, I'm on a mission, so whether you want it or not, you've got my help this afternoon. What can I do for you? What is it I can help you with? So I'm disturbing the dust, and as I do so, I'm vacuuming it up. Thank <laughs> you very much, Sophie. Nice to see you. Nice to see you too, and thank you very much for your help. Now, it's not every day that someone makes a present of the past for me and I get to tread in the footsteps of a giant of history like Henry VIII here, even if I didn't get to be master of the house, which I guess is something then for me to aim for on my next visit. Bye for now.